Hey, I'm back with a new video. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you all how to make a hack version of this video I made in January 10th, 2021. I, I don't really care about that. So, like two people requested to make a hack version, so I really had to make it. So let's begin. So firstly, um, you should have hats, and I have two here. Um, so yeah, I got it from the toolbox actually. You can just search um, hat here and then you can now find some hats and once I got him it's a it's like a hat object and I don't think it's there in the this thing anymore like there's no hat object in the uh, thing here I don't know why but uh, you should probably see why that's the problem but I'll look into it but um so first you should have the hat and one thing you should know is uh, whenever the hat is a child of an um dummy object which has a humanoid and if it detects a head then it will um basically position itself in the head so if I now take this and uh, put it in this dummy it will automatically uh, position itself and you can even position it properly if it's uh, covering the face you don't want that then here attachment position from the y value put it oops minus one that's too much uh, point two there you go so now it will be better so that's one thing um so now that you know that you can uh, implement it in a script so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna not use that and instead use this all right so what you gotta do is put this in uh put this inside the dummy oh my bad so it will be positioned in all right so now we need anything to uh, like interact with the dummy so I usually use proximity prompt to show it and make a script inside the dummy so first let's get the dummy which is script up here and let's get the proximity prompt which is inside the dummy and uh, now we just need to trigger the proximity prompt so whenever we press E we will interact with the dummy so proximity from dot trigger connect to a function it will always return the player whoever is uh, triggering it so we can get the character of the player that's how you get the character now we need to do a simple check to see if this dummy uh, uh, I mean has the uh, hat so we can do is local check equals to dummy find first child and put the name of the hat okay so now if um if the dummy has the hat then this check will return true or if it doesn't have then it will be false so we can just say if check equals to true then um you can just say if check too because then it means if true so let's say if check then you need to give it to the player right so whenever the player interacts if you want this uh, to clone then you clone it and put it to the player if you want this to just give it to the player then yeah do do what i'm doing right now so do this so check uh check the parent is the character and that's pretty much it this is the script let's say else print already no the dummy does not have a hat to equip uh, print equipped hat alright so now if I just play the game it should work fine So if I interact, so let me just bring up the output here. 
you can see we equip the hack and if you try to equip again the dummy does not have any hack to equip so the next bonus uh, thing I'm going to be showing you is how to clear any hats the any hat the um, dummy is wearing so I want to make a small function here so call local function clear hat uh, clear hats and then it's gonna give the character here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna say for iv in for uh, obj in pairs character get children do yeah so if obj is a um hat uh hold up think accessory will work but let's go with it so then obj destroy so now we just need to call this function here so it will clear all the hats of the character and do the thing i don't know why hats is not there in roblox anymore like people asked but it's like not there anymore no idea why but let's just take a look oh yep you see I just um, equipped the hat and it cleared all my other stuff like my hat and shit so yeah that's the thing and now if you want to like not clear the dummies hat then you do this here uh, local C it is to check clone and make this this it's pretty much this will like not uh, remove the hat from the dummy so as you can see I just equipped a hat so now I'm just gonna make duplicate this and uh, put this hat in it Oops, my bad. Alright, so once I do this, make sure you go to the script and change the name to Straw Hat. I mean, there, uh, there might be easier ways to do this without changing the name here, but I'm just gonna go like this, alright? So. alright great so here we have two dummies this will give us this hat and this will give us hold up alright alright I see what's happening inside of the script uh, oh yeah we spelled it wrong all right. So if I equip this, it will equip this, and if I equip this, it will equip this. Um, even though the hat is still there. Yeah. Let's see what's wrong with that. So, oh, J is a I don't remember what we call it. I don't think that will work. So yeah, I will look into it and I will um, tell how to fix that in the comment because I need to uh, go and research on why that's not there anymore. But yeah, this is how you do it. So you got the main idea. Yeah, so hope you enjoy. I have better content coming soon. Mm, yeah, so.
Peace.